Every Friday morning, crowds of people descend on St. Anthony's in Briar Hill to take part in one of the great Youngstown traditions. Briar Hill is in our soul. We make it authentically. Peppers and tomatoes on dough. It just brings back good memories. It's the pizza the way they made in Italy. It's the kind of pizza that my grandmother made. People come from everywhere to get it. The smell, I said they should make a candle, Briar Hill pizza candle. When we have Briar Hill pizza, it's a treat. One regular and one hot sausage. This is Italian pizza and everybody here was familiar with that and they want to continue it and uh, keep that tradition the way it was done in the old country. Everything came from the garden. The tomatoes, cook them down a little bit. The peppers, the same thing. A little bit of cheese and that's it. Good eating. <laughs> Fire Hill Pizza is a widespread piece of pastry, as it was originally intended, that was made everywhere, including Briar Hill. We started making Briar Hill pizza because I was available, Steve was still working, and I came down to help. We thought we'd come occasionally, and it became an every week thing. And as long as we can do that, I hope we can keep going. They kind of suck you in, and you keep going. I think the mid-50s, is one pizza, Briar Hill, the name Briar Hill Pizza, and that became prominent and, and got popularized. It's made with love. The people are excited for what they do. Everything is made from scratch. We uh, do all our own peppers uh, during ca uh, canning season. They make the dough. Everything is made fresh every Friday. And we cut them and then we put them in trays with a little bit of oil and water. The sauce is made, the dough is made. You go to buy Briar Hill Pizza, they want to add onions, mushrooms, sausage, and that, that was not the original Briar Hill Pizza. We have some pretty steady customers. My older sister from Florida told me about it. She loves Briar Hill Pizza, so she told me, Colette, I'll give you the money go get it, and that's why I'm here. We have individuals who come and buy two or three pizzas. We also have local institutions, hospitals, um, the police department, the fire department, uh, area businesses. And this is what you see in St. Anthony's. They're still sticking by the Briar Hill Pizza. It's important to keep it in the area. You know, this is like a well-kept secret, like wedding soup and um, the cookie table at the wedding. So it's just one of those things that's local. Having traditional foods and traditional values kind of brings back that, that family unity. And I think in, in some small way, our, our pizza making embraces that culture not only for the tradition, but also for the church. The church really uh, needs the income from the pizza. I see people with a lot of ailments that I don't have, and they're still here, so we'll come. That is our tradition, Briar Hill, and we hope to keep that alive, and pizza alive forever. It just makes me remember, remember the way things were. If we didn't come back, they'd come looking for us. We don't let anybody out.